Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we are gonna go back to show you guys some vending machines. Yes, we found some new vending machines, a whole bunch of them near our home and we can't wait to try these out. We've never tried the food from these vending machines. They're all hot food. We cannot wait to share them with you guys. This video is sponsored by Boksu. More on them later. So we're standing here in front of Asagaya Station. Asagaya Station is on the Chuo, Chuo line. line. Next to Koenji Station. Next to Koenji Station. Mm. So it's pretty much like, it's literally in our neighborhood. We always go to Koenji and Asagaya all the time. It's walking distance from where we live. Asagaya is a great place to visit for anyone who wants to experience some local culture. Asagaya is famous for their very, very long Shotengai, which is a traditional Japanese shopping street. And Asaga is also famous for their food, right? Yes. You told me that yes. a long time ago. Yes. Right? <laughs> there is no undelicious place in Asaga. Yeah, that's what they say. <laughs> anyway, this vending machine place is located in between Asagaya and Koenji, but closer to Asagaya, which is why we're going to start the video here. Super easy to get here, guys. All you have to do is go across from the station to the place called Beans. It's where all the restaurants and some shops are located. Uh, walk through there and then you will end up at Gold Street. Walk through Gold Street, you will get to Aluk or Aluk Street. <laughs> and this is where the vending machines are located. You will find three sets of vending machines. By the way, all the places under the railroad. Yes, that's, sure. that's a very interesting point. Yes, 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 that's right. The JR Chuo line is running right above our heads. So, first two are ramen vending machines. Everything is a very popular, popular ramen shops. And um, good gyoza here. Yeah, I want to try, not today. We already ate the ramen from vending machine. So yes. The we'll only thing today. though is that there is ramen from your hometown, Yamagata. Yes, yes. Right this over is here. from my hometown. That looks delicious. Do you know this shop? I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> but Torichika, the chicken, uh, chicken ramen, mm. is very popular in Yamagata. Chicken ramen? I've never yes. heard of that. The other thing I'm interested in trying is the Utsunomiya gyoza. Mm. Utsunomiya is famous for gyoza. Yes. yes. Yeah. Anything else looks interesting to you here that we can try maybe next time? Yes, many. Many. <laughs> <laughs> but like Satoshi said, we are going to be saving the ramen for a next video. Another video. We are going to walk right next to the next set of vending machines. By the way, this place is called Goryo Moru. Goryo Moru, and they are open 24 hours. Here is a very interesting. This is a Kinai Shok in flight meal. In flight meal. Oh you my can gosh. Only, you can eat only in International flights. International flights. <laughs> Lokomoko. Lokomoko. <laughs> My goodness. Oh, by the way, Lokomoko is 1,000 yen. Mm -hmm. Okay. And Coca Van from France. Where is this from? Shrimp and the Yuzu Gosho. Cream sauce. Cream sauce. Mm -hmm. From where is this? It's a fusion of Japan, Japan and, America. and America. Huli Huli Chicken. Huli Huli Chicken. And Paella. Paella from Spain. This is Asian cuisine. Asian cuisine. Yes. Thai gapao rice. Gapao rice. But rice is not included. Okay. Korean chijimi is okay. a pajong. Pajong. Okay. Taiwan ruroham. Okay. Kimbap. Kimbap. I see Korean sushi. And then over on this side, this is canned sweets. Awesome. Canned we got cake. desserts, canned cakes. And they're different from the other one in Osaka or the one in Harajuku. It's mm -hmm. quite different. This is from a place called Koganea Puffet Can. Mm -hmm. Koganea. Okay. Strawberry one. Which is strawberry one. Chocolate one. Uh -huh. Chocolate banana. Okay. Matcha and kuromi too. Awesome. That's not all, Satoshi. That's not all. They have pudding on the mold. They have strawberry rare cheesecake. So there's like five different types wow. in this one machine. And next one is a pizza vending machine. Pizza and pasta. Pizza and pasta. Margarita pizza, uh -huh. it's not round style, it's a square, bec maybe because of the, the vending machine. Okay. Mar pizza margarita mix, mentai carbonara. Oh my gosh, okay. And carbonara spaghetti and meat sauce. I see. And by the way, the pizzas, there are two slices of pizza in each box, 4,000 yen, and there are two servings of pasta in each 
purchase. Finally, we're here at the omusubi cake machine. Cake. Yes. It's interesting. But it's called yeah. omusubi cake. Omusubi style cake. <laughs> omusubi cake. You have the uh, tiramisu, you have milk tea, and you have cookie and cream. Three different types of omusubi cake. Okay, the hardest part, guys, is choosing as usual. Okay, we're walking over to the last set of vending machines here at Goryeo Mall. Yes, this is gyoza and shumai. Gyoza and shumai. It's dumpling and shumai. Okay, I just noticed that it's a gyoza from three different shops. Yes. Okay. Kinneko. Kinneko. Kujo Negi gyoza from Itoya. Okay. Kurobuta gyoza denden. Right. And you also have shumai. shumai. It's from Tokyo. Tokyo. Shinjuku. And this one is a okonomiyaki. Okay. Wow. Frozen. This machine is called Osaka Kitchen. Osaka Kitchen. So many. And this one is interesting. Sendai Gyutan Densetsu. From Sendai. Sendai is popular for Gyutan. Which is beef tank. Beef tank. Yes. Variety of beef tank. And not only beef tank, these are hormone. Hormone, which are, are like intestines. Intestines. Right, which we don't really love. And this is interesting. It's unagi. Unagi. And other things. Uh -huh. the unagi, Kumamoto no unagi to sagamai bento. This is the using saga rice, satsuma krobuta hamburger bento, and simibi gyu beef yakiniku. Okay, so these are like in-flight meals. They look That's like right. in-flight meals. This right. includes the rice as well. Mm -hmm. Interesting. The last machine is another ramen machine, of course. Like I said, we're not going to get any ramen today. Uh, this one is from Fukuoka. Uh, Fukuoka, actually, Ippudo. Ippudo ramen. Oh my goodness. So, Ippudo ramen. Yeah, Ippudo ramen. And, and there's another Yamagata ramen shop here. And then there is a ramen shop from Hokkaido and Kanagawa. Amazing, so much ramen to choose from. Wow, you can have like your own ramen tour from these vending machines, incredible. All right guys, we bought our stuff. All we have to do is go take it home, cook or heat it up and- Microwave. Enjoy, yeah, that's right, <laughs> microwave. And in, uh, no, actually the, we have to, um, put the uh, pizza in the toaster oven, right? That's, Ooh, that's yeah, right. we can't microwave that one. But anyway, all right, uh, let's go home and let's go enjoy the food. All right, guys, we are back home. Oh my God, it started raining. <laughs> like really, really hard. No, I had an umbrella. You did, I didn't bring an umbrella. I didn't think it was gonna rain. Smart man, yes. weather man. I'll call you weather the weather man. man. <laughs> the weather man from now on. Before we get started, I do want to tell you a little bit about our friends at Boksu. I Many of you guys love them just like we do. But for those of you that don't know, Boksu is a subscription service that delivers premium Japanese snacks and tea pairings straight from Japan to your doorstep. Many of the companies they work with are family businesses, and it's incredible. And that's something we love about Boksu. Um, Boksu has a special theme every single month. This month they have a very special theme. It's the Sakura box. It's the box that we look forward to every year. Uh, it comes in this beautiful, beautiful collector's edition box. And all the snacks are Sakura theme or spring theme. Now we've already tried all of these snacks and we did have some favorites. And we both agreed that we love the matcha choco Arare. This is a Boksu exclusive. It comes with two types of snacks in here. One is a arare with some uh, matcha powder and the other one is a matcha chocolate covered arare mm -hmm. rice cracker, which is incredible. These were some of the best snacks we've had from Boksu so far. And a lot of exclusives this month. Click on the link in the description below this video. And don't forget to use our code to get $15 off your first order. Trust us guys. You don't want to miss this one. Oh my God, the snacks in this box. Absolutely amazing. Alrighty. So, frozen mm. foods. Frozen foods. I hope you don't mind. I'm going to be snacking on the boxy rice crackers. OMG. No, I'm hungry. <laughs> so this is pizza palmo. And you can use the oven toaster, a frying pan, or an oven. And then we're leaving out the desserts on the table because they need to defrost. The omusubi cake comes with two omusubi cakes. 
Yay. Very happy to see that. Yeah, very happy. The pizza is ready and it looks so good. But it smells good. Once again, we got the margarita pizza. I usually like to have margarita first because it's very simple. Um, this one has tomato sauce, it has cheese, and it also has some basil, basil. sauce, huh? Dogmos! Mmm. Oh. It's good. Mmm. Mm. Crust. Mmm. This is Very, very crispy. Mmm. Oh my god. Oh my god. The cheese and the tomato tanginess mm. is really good. Yeah, you know, actually, you know, I was looking over the footage that we took of the vending machine, and it says that this is actually made by a uh, an Italian chef. Yes. So. You know, well, Japanese uh, chef who makes Italian food. But look at the bottom. Look how beautiful the, the crust looks on the bottom. Mm. You want to eat this because of the sound. Mm -hmm. Well, it's cheesy. Yes. Mm. Mm. Oh my god. It's hard to believe this is from a vending machine. Yeah. If you are staying here as a tourist, you will need a kitchen to make this. So. That's the only thing. Usually hotels don't have oven toasters or, or mm. ovens. Mm. Next, we're gonna try out the, the meals. The airline looking meals. These <laughs> are not airline meals. Um, I, I do want to make a video of the airline meals, vending machine. I can't believe we have one in our neighborhood. You know, they have the same one at Haneda Airport. That's far. So yeah, if this is something you, want, you guys want to see, let us know in the comments down below, please. You don't have to go to the airport to buy and I mean, you don't have to fly. <laughs> you don't have to fly. That's what my. This one is a uh, um, yuniku. So yu yakiniku, yakiniku, mm. uh, barbecue beef. Mine is krobuta hamburger juice. The hamburg is ready, and it looks delicious. It smells delicious. It's a pork hamburg steak. Yeah. And on top it's demigrass sauce. Okay, with some mushrooms maybe. Mushroom. Yeah, and it oh, comes mushroom. with um, asparagus and carrots as well. Okay, so let's give this a try. Itadakimasu! Itadakimasu! So, hamburg first. Hamburg. Mmm! Mm. Oh, that's pretty good! Beyond my expectation. Me too! It's frozen food. Mm. My expectation for uh, frozen food mm -hmm. is quite low, but this one is beyond, beyond frozen food. Yeah, so this is pork hamburger, 100% mm -hmm. pork. Mm -hmm. It tastes really good and it's not dry at all. I prefer this frozen hamburg to, for example, like some family restaurant chains versions <laughs> of hamburg. I'm not like a huge fan of, you know, that one. Carrot is a little um, texture, maybe sort of Indian. <laughs> like frozen carrots? Frozen carrots. Mm. Mm. The rice is cooked really well. Good. Rice is good. Mm. Really good. Mm. It's not sticky. Mm. It's not undercooked or overcooked. Mm. Mm. I'm pretty happy with this. Mm -hmm. Are you happy mm -hmm. with this? Yeah. You know? Mm. It's just the vegetables. It's like frozen vegetables. Mm. But you know, these are frozen, so... Pork meat. Mm. Hamburger steak is very tasty. Mm. That is delicious. Oh my goodness. I am very happy with this. This is 900 yen, right? Yeah, mm. yeah. That's not bad. That's a pretty fair price for this quality. Okay, yakiniku. So this one is beef, barbecue beef. 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 And try the beef, beef first. Beef? Yeah, let's try the beef first. Okay. Takimasu. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, this is good. Mmm. Sweet tare. Sweet oh, sauce flavor. Mm. Good. Okay. And it's like char grilled flavor. Yes. And very nice cute oh. beef. Mmm. It actually tastes mm. like they've grilled this over a flame. I wonder if they did that. It tastes like, you know, flame grilled barbecue beef. And um, beef is not fun. Mm. It's tender. It's tender. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. And this comes with a side of um, namu. namu. The bean sprouts, um, wood ear mushrooms, and carrots. Like a mm. mixture of that. Mm. Mm -hmm. No, very nicely seasoned. This is good too. Yeah, sesame mm -hmm. oil, mm -hmm. really, really flavorful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the rice is cooked just as good as the other one we just had. What I'm comparing this to is I'm comparing this to, say, a yakiniku bento from 7-Eleven. 
I usually don't love it because the, the meat is soft and there's none of this like flame grilled flavor or texture. You don't get any char on the meat. But this one, definitely some char. I, I, I like it. I, I like that it doesn't feel like I'm eating something that's been microwaved. I want to this vending machine near our house. No, I don't want it. Why? No, because it'll be too convenient. <laughs> All right, so we got two desserts today. One is the omusubi cake from Osaka, and the other one is Koganeya sweets can. Parfait. Pudding a la mode parfait. Pudding a la mode parfait! Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so high expectations for the desserts as well. <clears throat> so this comes with two onigiri cakes. It's omusubi really cakes. like a kombini onigiri. Yeah. <laughs> That's so cute. And the way to open mm. is the same as kombini onigiri. Put this tab to down. Right, and then the left. There we go. Okay, okay. There we go. It's really like omusubi. It looks exactly <laughs> like onigiri. Wow. Wow, that's so interesting. What is this nori sheet made with? I think with? it's a crepe. Crepe? Yeah, but very I'm thin. assuming. It's very thin. And then there's sponge cake and that's some kind of like pie and then cream on the inside. Whoa. Okay, that's your half. Thank you. We just cut it in half right now. And it looks good. It looks like a proper cake now. Mm. I'm enjoying this rice board. Oh, rice board. Omusubi. <laughs> Yo, look at that. Okay. All right. I was mesmerized by this. Itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. Mmm. Mm. What is this? Mmm. Very refreshing. What is this refreshing product? It's milk it's tea. It's milk tea. It's tea flavor. Tea flavor? Mm. Wow. So it's cold. So. It's very feed is very refreshing. It, it's like drinking a cold uh, milk tea. Mm. That's what it tastes like. Mm. And you know the textures are nice because you have the I guess the crepe on the outside, but it feels like nori the texture. It's very dry, very thin. Mm -hmm. Very very thin. Mm. But the cake the the cake has specks, which looks like real tea leaves. Tea and tea jelly. I think it's tea jelly on the inside. Oh. Oh, it's mm. 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 Okay, so we got one more dessert, and this one is that pudding parfait, and it should be completely defrosted now. It's been about an hour. It says wait for an hour, and this one has uh, multiple layers of ingredients. It's really beautiful. It has whipped cream, of course. I see sponge cake. I see fruits. Maybe that's the caramel sauce, and there should be pudding, of course, because this is a pudding parfait. It's beautiful. The strawberry, orange, and the kiwi, kiwi. roots. Ooh. Mm. Okay, let's right. take it. Yeah, let's let's try to get all the components. Itadakimasu. Dozo. I hope there's pudding in that bite. Was your pudding? Is it good? Oishi? Oh, so happy to hear that. You know, Oishi. pudding critic here. Mm. Oishi? It's not just oh. pudding. It's a little fruity, fruity refreshingness in this pudding. Oishii! <laughs> mm. Oishii! Oh my god, I, my, my mouth just watered. It's oh, melted in my mouth. Mm. Mm -hmm. I didn't have the, the, the sponge part. Yeah, me neither. Is there a sponge in here? I think this is a sponge. You think no. it's a sponge? It's I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I'm gonna try it. Mm. It's sponge. sponge. You're right, mm. it's sponge. The caramel on the bottom or in between or somewhere, somewhere, mm. it's amazing. Mm. Oh, the bottom part is a little hot, hot, hot. Yeah, yeah, there's some something on the bottom. Ice cream? No, I don't think it's ice cream. Is it ice cream? Is it ice cream? No. It's... it's... What should I say? Fake ice cream. Fake, fake ice, ice cream, cream that means, does not sound delicious. Fake ice cream means um, non-melted ice cream. Non-melted ice cream. Fake mm -hmm. ice cream. So, what is that on the bottom? It is something what, very is, hard what, on the bottom. Do you understand? Do you know in Japan, huh? in Japan, there is a uh, non-melted ice cream. This is like that. 
whatever it is, it's one of the best puddings I had. <laughs> like, is, isn't it amazing? Mm. This is pretty hot. Mm. Oh god, I'm licking wow. my spoon. Wow. Okay, that's pretty amazing. Mm. This is a really good pudding. Mm. It's worth it. My mouth keeps watering. Yep. Yeah. It's worth it. It is. Mm. It is. Like, I would get this again. I probably have cravings for this. It's convenient. It's super convenient. We can take this uh, to picnic. <laughs> Oh, that's if true. we have a insulation bag, right? Or if you're if you at the park in an hour, because you do have to defrost it, you know, for an hour. Okay, that was delicious. I am so happy. Everything we tried. Everything today was all very good. Was really good. Yeah. Mm. Bending. Yeah, it's a frozen food, yeah. and from it bending from bending machine. Mm. Mm. So. Expectation was not so high. Yeah, because you know, frozen fruit from the supermarket can sometimes, well, many often be very bland and boring. Yeah, during the pandemic, number of that kind of vending machine are increasing. Yes, true. It's true, and and for some reason they are still increasing. It seems. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you can mm -hmm. find them all over now. Mm -hmm. The most of the case, they put very good things. Yes, so so I am really amazed. Uh, so far. You know this kind of uh, vending machine food. Um, this is maybe like our second time. Second time, right? First time was ramen, ramen, which was amazing. It was like restaurant quality. And I gotta say, these. I don't think you should look at this as your typical frozen food because it's on a different level. Like frozen food from the supermarket. To be honest with you, we're not huge fans. Maybe we should try. And look for some really good frozen food supermarket, but these are really, really good. I am impressed. I am impressed. Now I would like to try another the another other items. From other vending machines. Yeah, there there are so many items to choose from today. Mm. Which ones were your favorite? <laughs> this was tough because as soon as he said it, I'm like, wait a minute. But everything was really everything was good. Pretty amazing. Oh we don't gosh. have to choose it. Okay, thank you. I, I don't think I, I can. I don't think I can. So thanks guys for watching. Really hope you guys enjoyed this one. And as always, let us know your thoughts and comments down below. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already done so. And once again, don't forget to check out Boksu. Just click on the link in the description below this video. Thank you for watching. See you on the next delicious video. Bye bye. Sayonara. See you next time.